Good evening. Good evening. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. Hello. Hello, Blanca. Hello, Floricia, Armando, Diana, Romeo, Cecia. Good evening, teacher. Hello. Good evening, Anderson. Hi, teacher. Hi there. Hope everything's all right. Maria Wendy is getting into the class. Okay, let's wait a little bit. Remember, it's important to be connected on time. You need to chill. Hello, Anna. Hello. How's everything? Hope you are okay. And hope your day was really nice. I can see Eniva there. Uh, Anderson. Okay, I got it, Anderson. Don't worry. I got your message. Elmer, hello, Elmer. Good evening. Hello, 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 hello. Elmer, are you there? Yes, teacher, I hear. Okay, so welcome. Welcome back. Hope you are ready to participate actively in the class. You know, this tonight's gonna be really nice because we you are gonna you're gonna create something in English. You will see. Uh, we have 60 minutes, and I think uh, 60 minutes are gonna be enough for you to create something in English. Uh, tomorrow, you know, tomorrow we're gonna have some review about about the midterm. Uh, hopefully you've been working in the midterm in the exam, right? For this week. Because tomorrow we're gonna have a general review on it. Tonight, we are gonna continue talking about uh, how to give directions in English. That's the topic we started yesterday. We're gonna continue with it tonight. But tonight, you are going to create something in English, as I said before. Well, I have 14 people still waiting for the rest. Mm. Okay, uh, email is just getting into the class. Uh, Elsa also. You see, some people are just getting into this session. This is our second week. Remember, second week. This is our second week. Next week, we're going to be in the third week. And you see, actually, we're at, at the middle of the curse. So you see, time goes so fast. It's um, it's amazing, actually, how time passes by. And we need to take advantage of it. Well, I will check list of tenders. I have uh, 15 people. Let me know. Say hello. Say present. So, uh, let me know that you are in the session now. Uh, I have Ana Graciela. Present, <clears throat> teacher. Ana Graciela is there. Anderson. Present, teacher. Uh, Armando. Present, teacher. Blanca. Present, teacher. Carlos Aníbal. I'm here. Cecia. I'm here, teacher. Dina Patricia. Diana, teacher. <laughs> oh, my goodness. I don't know why I say Dina. I said I'm Diana. here, teacher. <laughs> uh, and, and yesterday I, I told you Dina. Uh, no, Diana. No, Diana, I'm sorry. I said yes. Dina. Yeah, I'm, <laughs> I'm sorry. My glasses are not working well tonight. <laughs> Diana, okay, Diana. And Elmer? Here, teacher. Okay. Um, Elsa Noelia? I'm here. Good. Uh, Floricia? I saw Floricia. Ingrid? So let me see if Floricia is here, if I'm not mistaken. Floricia? Can you say hello, Floricia? 
Yeah, Florice is there. But I don't know why she cannot speak. I don't know. Teacher, aquí estoy. Lo que pasa es que la señal me está fallando. Ah, okay, Floricia. Okay, but I, I, I already checked that Tia Teens. Ingrid? So, Ingrid? Jaime? Okay, Jaime, so here. Eh, Karina? Jamilet. I'm here, teacher. Okay. Karina is here. Carla Gabriela. Carla Gabriela. Kenny. Kenny Guadalupe. María Imelda. Hi. Hi. María Wendy. Present teacher. Marisol de Los Ángeles. Present teacher. Nelson uh, Rutilio. Present teacher. Romel. Present teacher. Ronald. Ronald, Ronald. Let's see, Ronald, what's going on? Well, Ronald is not here yet. And Wilfredo. I'm here, teacher. <clears throat> Good. Fantastic. Well, uh, yesterday, as I said uh, before, we started with the topic on how to get directions in English. And you had a homework, right? You had a homework. Uh, can he... Okay, Kenny, don't worry, I will check it now. Kenny, run. Kenny, Kenny, Kenny. Okay, Kenny, don't worry. And uh well we were we started to talk about prepositions of, of place, right? So there are some prepositions of place that we can use whenever we are asked to give or to ask for directions, right? And also we were talking about different places in town. So I think we have been taking uh, uh, advantage of time. Yeah, Kenny, I got it, Kenny. Uh, we were talking <clears throat> we were talking about how to give directions in in, um, in English and also how to ask for directions. Tonight we're gonna be like working for a couple of minutes in order to produce something that's really significant. Well, I will start as soon as possible because you're gonna need some time uh, to put into practice what we've been working on lately. Okay, so that's why I decided to go directly to this conversation. Okay, it's a conversation in which there are some people uh, talking about giving directions in English and uh, having a conversation, which is something that we're going to be uh, like in church of creating um, a situation tonight. Mm, let me see. So actually, uh, the objective, as you can see, is um, to learn how to ask and give directions. And besides that, uh, we're going to practice a conversation which illustrates how this topic is used in a real life setting. So, let us see this conversation. Then, <laughs> this is one option, okay? This is an example only. Later, we're going to see some other examples. And then, you, well, we're going to work in trios, okay? Group of, of three people. And we're going to see if we can create a conversation. Please. In this class, you'll learn how to ask for and give directions. Additionally, you'll practice a conversation which illustrates how this topic is used in a real life setting. Let's get started by listening to a conversation titled, Is it far from here? Let's listen and practice. Excuse me, ma'am. Can you help me? 
How do I get to St. Patrick's Cathedral? Just walk up 5th Avenue to 50th Street. St. Patrick's is on the right. Is it near Rockefeller Center? Yes, it's right across from Rockefeller Center. Thank you. And where is the Empire State Building? Is it far from here? It's right behind you. Just turn around and look up. <laughs> We're going to practice giving directions now. Let's practice these phrases and vocabulary to give directions. Okay, listen and repeat. How do I get to Rockefeller Center? How do I get to the Walk Rockefeller Center? Walk up Fifth Center? Avenue. Go up Fifth Avenue. Turn left on 49th Street. It's on the right. How can I get to Bryant Park? Walk down Fifth Avenue. Go down Fifth Avenue. Turn right on 42nd Street. It's on the left. So, let me summarize the vocabulary we must learn. Listen. Four questions. How do I get to? How do I get to? Place. It's important. What for? Or, how can I get to? Then we mention a place. That's the same, right? Four to locate answers. the place. Walk up. Walk up. Go up. Go up. Walk down. Walk down. Go down. Go down. Turn left turn on. Turn left on. Turn right on. Turn right on. The on. Right, on the on right. The left. On the left. Make sure you memorize this vocabulary as it will be essential to ask for and give directions. All right. So this is very, very now, simple, let's try very to basic. Analyze the expressions. Walk up or go up. Walk up, the go up. The first thing we want to do when giving directions is to have a departing point. Where are you located and where do you want to go? Let's say that we are at the Empire State Building and we have a question like the example shows. How do I get to Rockefeller Center or how can I get to Rockefeller Center? The first instruction would be walk up Fifth Avenue walk or up. go up go Fifth up. Avenue. Now let's pretend that we are at 42nd Street and Madison Avenue. And we want to get to St. Patrick's Cathedral. St. Patrick's the Cathedral. The question would be, how question. do I get to St. Patrick's Cathedral? How do I get to? Or how can I get to? How St. can Patrick's I get to? Cathedral? How do I get? How can I get? The first instruction would be, walk up Madison Avenue. Walk up. Or go up. Go Madison up Avenue. Now let's pretend we are at St. Patrick's Cathedral. St. Patrick's Cathedral. And we want to get to New York New Public, York Library. Public Library. The question would be, how do I get to New York Public, Public Library. Library? Or how can I get to New York Public Library? Okay. The first instruction would be. Walk down. What down? Fifth That's the opposite, Walk, right? Go down fifth. What down? Go down. So, what is the next step to get to New York Public Library? For that, we will use the vocabulary: turn right on, or turn left turn on, right, turn depending left. on where our destination is. So, to answer that question, we will say, turn right on 42nd Street. So what is the last step after turning right on 42nd Street? For that, we will use the vocabulary on the right or on the left. So in this case, it's on the left. Now it's your turn to practice. I would like for you to give directions using this map. Also, try to give directions to your local supermarket, hospital, school, park, etc. All right. So I won't repeat the information because, you know, I have more information on here. Now, uh, this uh, link is going to be useful for you. Look at it at the chat. Okay, because you are going to use it tonight. And also, you're going to listen to... Uh, are you going to use the following? Uh, actually, I have prepared, I have looked for information in two websites. Okay. Now, the first one contains a lot of expressions that we can use. 
when asking or when giving directions directions in English. Now, when asking for and giving direction in English, you can use, excuse me, can you tell me the way to the museum? Excuse me, how do I get to the post office? Pardon me, I'm lost. How do I get to the cafe? So and you are gonna and you're gonna counter lot, right? So actually, in order to ask for um, a location, you have thirty-two expressions. Thirty-two. I am looking for this address. I'm in the right place. How do you get to the bus stop? Hey, what's the quickest way to of getting to the supermarket, etc. So you see, we have wow, more than that, forty-six. 46, actually we have 55 statements. Now when giving directions, you can use this. It's this way, it's that way. You're going to the wrong way. You're going in the wrong direction. Take the first left, take the second right, turn right at the crossroads, continue straight ahead for about a mile, etc. So you have a lot of material over here. Okay, you have a lot of material here. And if you go to this part, okay, to the next um, to the next um, link, you will encounter more. Take the blue line, continue going straight, change to the to the great line. How long you thought about a length of time? Take the right, cut it. I understand. Do you understand? Go straight, opposite. Take the first. Take the second. Take the third. Go right, continue straight on, turn, well, actually, you just name it. And you have first dialogue, taking the subway, this is one option. Second dialogue, taking directions over the telephone. Third dialogue, practice dialogue directions to the museum. Four dialogue, directions to the supermarket. And that's it. So we have four options. Now, I will let you know what we're going to do in a very quick way. Vamos a tomarnos 5, 10, 15, 20 minutos. 20 minutos para que ustedes se memoricen cualquier diálogo, diálogo de los que tienen acá. Y ya luego ustedes van a crear un nuevo diálogo. Otro diálogo. No ninguno de los que están acá. Sino uno nuevo. Ok, pero para comenzar, quiero que practiquen cualquiera de estas conversaciones a modo de aprendérselas, ok, buscando pronunciación en la web, a, tratando de sonar lo más naturalmente posible, etc. Pero sí necesito que los practiquemos, ok. Ustedes elegen una conversación y la practican. Yo voy a hacer las parejas, ok. ¿Estamos bien? Ok, ok. Voy a crear. Mmm, fíjense que estoy pensando en crear grupos de tres, porque algunas veces, si alguien tiene problemas técnicos, pues se auxilian con otra persona. Ok. Entonces, pues mejor vamos a hacer grupos de tres. Perfecto. All right, so, so we're going to work now. Remember. Time to practice as much as possible by using the expression. If you want to include an expression that I have just uh, uh, presented, would be all right. So Ingrid, I saw your message. Okay, I will check list attendance. Don't worry, Ingrid. So are you ready, people? Are you ready? So, so, teacher. Yes. <laughs> Why yes. say so, so? No, you say yes, teacher. I'm more than ready. I'm more than ready. Okay. Teacher, nos va a mandar el enlace de los diálogos. Yeah, actually it's in the in the chat. No sé ah, si okay. lograron visualizarlos en el chat. Okay. So they're in the chat. We share them again. Let me know if you can see them. All right. So there you are. In the they... group, teacher. Well, actually, in the. Uh, I hear. Uh, no, no, in the chat, uh, but, uh, Floricia. Over here in the chat. Thank you. All right. So now we're going to start. Now we're going to work in trios, right? Group of three people. 
Uh, let me see, we are 23. Okay. Here we go. Here we go. Miren, chicos, este, si alguien por algún motivo tiene problemas técnicos, no, no se tengan. Tienen el enlace, practíquenlo, ¿ok? En caso alguien enfrente problemas técnicos. Esperemos que no sea así. Here we go. Okay, teacher. Me, I have problem. Ah, uh, okay. So, but, uh, hopefully. I uh, okay, but you have the link, right? So you can you can practice through the link. Here we go. Okay. <coughs> See you in a couple of minutes. Lo veo un par de minutos, okay? Yo me voy a estar metiendo a los diferentes uh, grupos para verificar eh, que efectivamente pues están practicando de la mejor manera. Here we go. 20 minutes. See you soon. Got it. Next day, tomorrow, to White Abbey. Two miles to White Avenue after that. Take a left on to 40th Street. Left, left on the for the street? The supermarkets on the left next to the bank. Wow. What is the afternoon? I turn on to Fort Street. It's not far, maybe about uh two and boy. <laughs> ¿Qué dice? ¿Qué terminó o qué? No, y dice... ¿Qué decía? No. Ah, ok, ok. <ríe> go ahead. Va. Go, yo go to the supermarket and buy some food. There's don't, don't, nothing to eat in the house. Eh, sure, but I don't know the way we just move it. Move it in. I why you come? I'll give. I you didn't you not to worry. Thanks. 
I take in all the strike. They are a rig. Right. 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 Then drive to meals to white habit. After that is another mil minute to no sé cómo se dice. The another. Min another. Another my two. Uh, oh. Let me write this down. I won't remember it. Okay. First day I write until in the time. No, a street. A street. Hello, hello, everybody. Uh, do you have any trouble, any problem? No. Are you are you practicing the conversation? Yes. Okay. Remember that you are going to tell us that conversation in a couple of minutes. Hope you can practice a lot. Practice a lot the conversation, please. I would really appreciate you can interact uh, among yourself. Ciento dos. Ajá. Y va a bajarse en, en la calle principal de Tamanique. Uh -huh. Y luego cruzar la calle y ahí adentro eh, hay como una entrada y ya está adentro en el tunco. Uh -huh. Vaya, entonces este cuando nosotros le, pre le preguntemos... Eh, Can you help? Can you help me? Usted va a decir, Yeah, sure. How can I help you? Otra vez, ¿es sure? Que no, no escucho bien cómo está cortada. Vaya, diría, Yeah, yeah sure. sure. How? How? Can you help me? How can I How help you? Can? ¿Cómo puedo ayudar? Ajá. How, how can I help you? Eh, nosotros vamos a decir, can you tell me? Can you tell me how to get to the beach? El tunco. ¿Ya lo tienen? Sí. Ajá. Eh, y ella nos va a decir... Eh, ¿Cómo sería en este caso? La, la calle, la calle que dijo... Eh, la eh, quería ¿verdad? cruzar... Ajá, bajarse en la calle este, principal de Tamanique y luego cruzar la carretera para entrar al Tunco porque hay que cruzar para va? cruzar sería en trave by a car or bus primero nos va a preguntar are you travel ajá uh -huh. are you travel esa es ah, la pregunta que me harían no, esa nos haría usted cuando 
cuando nosotros ya le preguntamos si nos podemos ir a la ¿cómo mm. nos, si nos puede decir cómo ir a la ¿Cómo playa? Nos vamos, a, cómo vamos a llegar entonces usted nos diría sí. este si nosotros vamos eh, eh, si nosotros estamos viajando en carro o en bus sí 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 are you entonces sería are you Travel by a the... car or bus? Bus travel. Do you travel by a car or bus? Nosotros vamos a contestar. Travel on bus. Entonces. ¿Cómo Yo diría bus? Claro. Ajá. Ella, ella va a preguntarnos si vamos a ir nosotros en carro o en bus. Entonces nosotros vamos a decir que en bus para que ella nos diga, nos diga que tenemos que abordar el bus número 102. ¿no? 102 o 107. No, pero la, la que nos lleva hasta allá. Sí. Ah, la que viene de la dirección de la Sí, porque si toman 102, hay que tomar otra ruta. Ah, claro. pues, vaya, entonces, digamos. Pero, sería la 107. La 107, ajá, es la que pasa frente a ese lugar. El 7. Uh -huh. 107. Aquello decía diálogo. Sí. Eh, practicamos ese. Ajá. Quiero ver. Ya dio cuál es. Sí, eh, buscando el año. Se dan diálogos en sí esto. En el número uno dice, I am sorry, I don't know. Es que envió dos links, pero creo que es el segundo. Quizás el otro es entonces. Vamos a ver, tres links hay. Quiero ver este otro. Aquí hay un enlace que comparte. De... Y así. Pero sí. sí. Hay, que, hay que meterle. Sí. <ríe> ¿Cuál va ahorita el de. Dirección. Oh. Ah, dirección para el supermarket. ¿Quién, ¿Quién inicia? No sé, dale vos. Ok. Could you go to the supermarket and buy some food? There is nothing to eat in the house. Uh, sure, but I don't know the way. We're just moving. It's the moving, moving, moving. Yeah. I will give you direction now to, to worry. Thanks. At the end of the strip, take a right, then drive to Mules to White Avenue. After that, it's another meal too. Aquí, eh, aquí les ayudo, si gusta. Este, then drive to Miles. Miles, Miles se escribe, se pronuncia Miles. Miles. Uh, Miles, Miles. To, White, to White Avenue. Avenue. After that, 
It's another mile too. Bueno, sí. dice Helen, let me write this down. I won't remember it. Okay, Fritz, take a right at the end of the strip. Got it. Hello. Hello. Okay. A ver, a ver, a ver. Es momento que Los tres tenemos que participar. Sí. Cuatro, tres, tres, ajá, sí. Tres, el. Tres. Sí, tres somos los. Ajá, ok, entonces. Sería. A Kenny como que le estaba fallando la señal, algo así, no se escuchaba cortado, no, me, me, me escribió ahí. Sí, no, no, no se escuchaba. Ya pasaron los 20 minutos. 
Hello. Sí, ya. Ahí en el chat enviar. Aquí lo envió. Bye. Entonces. No nos va a caer tiempo para practicar, sí. Ay, no. Ya nos llaman. Eh... Pero ahí hay que... mm, no lo va a capturar ahí para que lo tenga. Un momento. Y eh, no me sale completa. ¿No te sale? No me sale completa. No la logro con, a capturar completa. Bueno, lo voy a hacer por dos. Ajá. What's the activity? Hello, hello. How was the activity? How is it? Hello, teacher. Hello, how was it? Interesting. Hello, Interesting. Interesting uh, and difficult. It, it, but, but that's good, right? Organization. It is good. When it is difficult, I really like that word. No le gusta la palabra difícil. Pues a mí. Yeah, a mí. ¿Saben por qué sí me encanta la palabra difícil? Porque cuando lo logramos, es más gratificante de que cuando logramos algo sencillo, algo fácil. Entonces, cuando decimos, ups, esto sí costó, pero lo logré, creo que es mucho mejor, ¿verdad? Ok, so, uh, let me see, we have like 5, 10, 15, like 20 minutes, right, in order to participate. I don't know if you, if you are ready, but we're gonna, we're gonna start. So this is the conversation that you were practicing, that the one, one of the conversations that, that it was in the link I shared with you, right? <laughs> now, I will, I will ask you to participate in order. I have group number one. That's a Jamilet, Maria, and Nelson. Group number one. Here we go. Jamilet, are you over here? Maria Wendy? Sure. Hello? Yo Hello? El último diálogo. Okay, it's all right. No problem, Nelson. Mm -hmm. There's no any problem. But I want to I wanna listen to you. Let me, know, let me know when you get ready, please. ¿Quién me acompaña? You decide. Uh, maybe like. Yo. Okay. Yo también estuve. Me agregó oh. después en ese grupo. Ah, okay. So, are you ready? Sí. Yes. Excellent. So, we, we're going to have the participation um, about the conversation for uh, by Ingrid and Nelson. So, let us start. Okay. Direction to a uh, supermarket. Uh, could you go to the supermarket and buy some food that are nothing to eat in the house? So, but I don't know the way. We'll be just move in. I will give you direction to not to worry. Thanks. At the end of the street, take a right, then right to Mills to to Right Avenue. After that, is another meal too. Let me write this now. I won't remember it. Okay, first take a right at the end of the street. Got it. Next okay. right. Next drive to Mills to White Avenue. Two miles to White Avenue after that. Take a left onto 40th Street. Left onto 40th Street. The supermarket is on the left next to the bank. 
How far is the after I turn onto 43? It's not far, maybe about 200 years. Okay, great. Is there anything special you want? No, just the usual wood. If you could get some beer that would be great. Great. Okay, use this arms. All right. That was it, Nelson and Ingrid. Wow, that was fantastic. Excellent job. Congrats. Congratulations. All right. So that, that was first couple. We're going to go over the group number two. We have Blanca, Cecia, and Diana. Okay. Okay, go Blanca. ahead. Blanca. I'm stoic. Go ahead. Yo inicio. <laughs> How are you going to the supermarket and buy some food? There's nothing, nothing to eat in the house. Ah, uh, sure, but I don't know the way. We've just moved in. I, I will do direction, direction, not to work, not, not to work. Worry. Worry. Thanks. <laughs> I at the end of this. Es, es, ay, se me olvida la palabra. Street. Street. Say a right. Then dry to meet to dry. Dry up after that. Eat another meal too. Uh, let me write the, this down. I won't remember it. Okay. First, they arrive at the end of the drive. I uh, got it. <laughs> Next, drive to meet to White Avenue. Uh, two miles to White Avenue after that. Take a leg on to. 14th drive. I live on to 14th Street. The supermarket is on the left next to the bank. How far is it after I turn on to 14th Street? It is not far, far. Might be out to, to 100 yards. Okay, great. Uh, is there anything special you want? No. Got the usual well is if you call it get some beer beer take word <clears throat> be <great. clears throat> Okay, just this once. <laughs> Excellent. Pretty good. Great job. Okay, great job. Okay. That was group Se number. Me fue la yeah, I'm sorry. <laughs> but actually, <laughs> you, you, you <laughs> had the opportunity <laughs> to practice, right? So we're going to go over uh, group number three <clears throat> that's Cecia, Jaime, and Romeo. ¿Quién me va a ayudar? ¿Cuál? Um, la, la segunda. 
the direction to the mutant. La segunda. Take direction over the telephone. Mm, ¿Qué es? Ah, ok. Um, ok. Hello. Yo empiezo. Bueno. Ustedes usan. Uh -huh. Hello. This is a dog. Uh, hi dog, this is this is Susan. Hi Susan, how are you? I'm fine. I have a question. Do you have a moment? Certainly. How can I help you? I'm driving to the conference center later today. Could you? Give me direction. Sure. Are you leaving home? Yes. Okay. Take a left onto Bertany Street and drive to the freeway entrance. Take the freeway toward Portland. How far is it to the conference center from my home? It's about 20 miles. Continue on the freeway the, to exit 23. Take the exit and turn right onto Broadway at, at the stock life. Stop, stop life. Let me repeat that, that. Take the freeway to exit 23. 23 and turn right onto Broadway. Broadway. That's right. Turn continue on Broadway for about two miles and then turn, turn left onto 16 Avenue. Okay. On 16th Avenue, take the second right onto the conference center. Okay, that's easy. Yes, it's very easy to get to. How long does it take to get there? Is there is no traffic. About 25 minutes. Uh, in heavy traffic, is take about 45 minutes. I'm leaving at 10 in the morning, so the traffic should show, show be so bad. Yes, that's right. Can I help you with anything else? No, that, that is it. That's for you help. Okay, enjoy the conference. <laughs> wow, that Thanks, was Doug. bye. That was bye. awesome. <laughs> Excellent. <laughs> that was awesome. Hey, that, I really like that. Okay, I really like your participation. Now we're gonna stop by here, uh, because I need to tell you something. Ok, nos va, vamos a tener por acá, eso no quiere decir que los demás participantes no van a tener su oportunidad, pero como el día de mañana, pues nos vamos a dedicar a mi term. Vamos a iniciar um, con las conversaciones pendientes. Eh, los que ya participaron también entran en el juego porque tienen que mejorar, eh, digamos, fluidez. Tenemos que lograr que suene aún más natural. Lo hicieron súper. No les digo que no. Lo hicieron súper. Pero recuerden, siempre podemos mejorar algo. A lo mejor no pronuncié bien algo. O lo dije muy, muy pausado. O pues pienso que lo pude haber hecho mejor. No sé. Pero mañana pues yo voy a elegir que... Quiero ver cuántos sales. Voy a elegir cinco, cinco, cinco uh, grupos 
que nos compartan esa conversación. Pueden ser los que part ya participaron ahora o pueden ser los que todavía no han participado. Todos deben de estar preparados para el día de mañana. Eh, dicho esto, pues miren, la hora se va súper rápido. Solo tenemos cinco minutos. Eh, Aníbal. Aníbal. Eh, eh, y si el, en vez de las conversaciones, bueno, mi punto es empezar. Y en vez de esas conversaciones que nos mandan el link, creamos nuestra propia conversación entre, no sé, entre los mismos que hicimos la sala y prepararnos para el día de mañana. No eh, sé, ¿qué sé Está bien, Aníbal. Pues tienen ambas opciones. De hecho, yo les dije pues que crearan una, ¿verdad? Pues de hecho, tiene... nosotros sí creamos una. Teacher. Ok, perfecto. No la terminamos, pero la llevamos a la mitad. Entonces, termínenla y mañana nos sorprenden con esa conversación. Ok. okay. A los que quieran, pues, pueden hacerlo también, crear una nueva conversación y, este, y presentarnos la mañana. Eh, objetivos para el día de mañana. Que esa conversación suene natural, con muy buena pronunciación, ¿ok? Eh, si tenemos duda okay. de alguna palabra, busquemos la pronunciación en la web y ahí resolvemos. Eh, voy, a, voy a pasar la lista y cerramos sin antes decirles que eh, se recuerden de trabajar en el midterm, ¿ok? El midterm es importantísimo. Mañana, pues, todos deberían de, de haber completado esa actividad. Dicho, Vaya, digan. Yo quería eh, mencionar algo de lo que estuvimos haciendo el día de ahora. Este, sí. Son de, de plática de grupo, ¿verdad? Este, eh, yo, en mi caso, hice un grupo aparte con el grupo, ¿verdad? Todo el módulo. Ajá. Y hice la consulta si no había problema en que nosotros pudiéramos tener el grupo y este, eh, pues mencionaron que no, con la única este, advertencia, ¿verdad? Que, que quieren evitar, ¿verdad? Eh, posibles problemas que hayan dentro del grupo. Claro. Quería... Es que... Sí, Ajá. sí recuérdense que pues um, hay personas que, que, que trabajan como, tienen su jornada muy, muy, muy cargada de actividad. Y algunas veces, pues, vamos, vamos a ser flexibles, ¿verdad? Porque sabemos que la mayoría acá trabaja. Y si alguien no puede reunirse, pues, eso es, es de entenderlo. Ajá. Sí, no, con el fin le hicimos de que estarnos apoyando entre nosotros. Pues. Claro. En cualquier caso que alguien, tal vez no sabemos, ¿verdad? Nosotros, pero algo vamos haciendo entre todos. No es lo mismo que uno solo vaya haciendo las cosas. Claro. Ok. Sí, me parece. Siempre y cuando nos traiga beneficio, es bueno. Ah, miren, tengo a alguien, solo una persona, pues no logró integrarse ahora. Solo lo voy a mencionar por cuestión de tiempo. Es Carla Gabriela, no sé si logró reunirse con nosotros. No, ha de tener, ha de haber tenido alguna dificultad. Ok, so... No sé si hay preguntas para el día de mañana. No, teacher. Ok. Yo sí tengo una este, con respecto a, a esta semana. Pues ya estamos aquí. Uh, uh, necesito también que, que, que revisen, por favor, este, los avances en la, en la plataforma. Algunas veces a algunos se les olvida como enviar el ejercicio ya completado y ahí les está pareciendo que no, que no han eh, terminado algunas actividades. No, no todo, ¿verdad? Pero en algunas ocasiones se da, se da esa dificultad. Recuérdense que para nosotros es importantísimo que ustedes logren obtener 80, 90 o el 100%, que es lo ideal, en su asistencia y en sus actividades. Ok. Teacher. Uh, tell me, Diana. Eh, quería preguntarle, vaya, por ejemplo, cuando nosotros hacemos un, un ejercicio en la plataforma y le damos a enviar y nos aparece malo, esa es la primera que cuenta. No, lo pueden repetir. Okay. Lo podemos arreglar. Sí, lo pueden corregir. Ah, ¿Sí? ok. Ajá. Es que para nosotros lo importante es el aprendizaje. 
por supuesto, el porcentaje es, es lo que complementa, pero lo primero es aprender. ¿verdad? Me equivoqué, lo corrijo, aprendo y obtengo buenos resultados. O sea, ese, mm. es, la, ese es el objetivo. Ok. Ok. Dicho esto, pues creo que nos quedamos por acá y nos vemos el día de mañana. Ok. Okay. Good night. Bye, teacher. See you tomorrow. Bye, teacher. Bye. See you tomorrow. See you tomorrow. <laughs>